Hey, what's up everybody? How you doing? Welcome back to Carpo Gaming and another Skull and Bones video. Today we have an amazing build for you. This snow ship is an absolute tank. Today I'm going to show you how you can set it up where you can solo pretty much anything inside of Skulls and Bones. And this thing is not. So let's go! Once again, thanks for watching everybody. Without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, let's get started. Now this build is awesome, my dude. Let's start off with the weapons. Now, the weapons are going to be pretty cool, but you're going to have to buy this. I'm starting off with the Twin Winch Ballista. You put whatever you want on the front. This is the Sniper, the best ballista in all of the game. Comes with double draw, so you can increase your damage, piercing too, and it also has weak point damage as well. So when you're facing off against bosses or any ship, you know, you get a little bit more damage. Alternatively, you can buy this from the black market for 400 of those sovereigns. Now, next up, we're moving on to our port and starboard weapons. And we're going to be using the Zamazama 3, basically the shotgun of the game. And this is going to provide some burning damage with burning 2 as well. But you got to get close, but since we're a tank, we can get close and don't have to worry about getting damage. You can buy this from the black market as well. Let's move on to our stern. We're going to go with the Sherlock Lone Knives. Now, this is a long range weapon. That's why it's mounted on the back. Or you can roll with the Dardanelle, something long range, so you can hit it from the back. All right, totally up to you. Now, both of these you can get from either the Black Market or you can buy the, the lovely Skurlock from Captain Skurlock. And then for the auxiliary weapon, put in anything that you want, mortars or rocket, totally up to you as well. Now that we got the weapons out of the way, let's move on to the armor and why I am using the Black Prince. Now the Black Prince is going to be awesome because if you ever get your health down low, it's going to give you 50% extra damage. And that's pretty cool when your health, whole health is lower than 30%. You can buy this for 450 of those, a lovely sovereign from the Black Market. Now let's move on to the furniture, and this is essential. The water tank. It reduces crew stamina depletion by 50%, and while braces increases stamina recovery by 20%. Now this is amazing since, you know, with the snow ship, we are basically a tank. So we're going to be using this to our advantage. You can buy this from the black market as well. Furniture slot number two, we're going to go with the front powder kegs, just so we can get more damage to our ballista weapon. And furniture number three, we're going to go with more acceleration as well because the ship is a little bit slow. That's just my personal preference. And number four furniture, we're going to go with increased max hull health. Since we are being a tank, a little bit more health definitely helps. Alternatively, you can switch out your third and fourth furniture and get more damage 10% to either side of your ship but you will have to buy these blueprints for 300 gold totally up to you how you want to build that now let's do some testing we're going to fight the magdalene so you can see exactly what i'm talking about front ballista weapon hitting that weak point fully charged 10k that is nice and that is why we are rolling with the twin ballista so we can hit him from distance now this boss will try to get close up to us, and that's why we have the Zamazam. So whenever we get close, we can brace for impact. We can negate pretty much all of the damage to hit him with the shotgun. Wash, rinse, repeat. Whenever you get a long ways away from you, you can either hit him from the front with your ballista or from the back with your Sherlock's long nines. So that is my setup, and it is awesome idea you see me tanking all of this damage right here you can pretty much solo anything in the game with this build everybody like the brigantine i like it too it's super fast but man it is nothing like tanking inside of skulls and bones so get out there my dude get after these parts some of them do cost a little bit of coin to make but when you set up everything with this snow ship you will have an absolute beast of a ship but for right now, that's pretty much going for the video. I hope you truly enjoyed it. Now, as always, if you're new to the channel, how you doing and welcome. Don't forget to subscribe right here at Carpool Game. Upload a wide variety of videos, ranging from updates, tips and tricks, guys and news, and a whole lot more. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. Once again, thank you everybody for all your love and support. And as always, I'll be seeing y'all in the next one. Later.